Now, I've also, and I've been in groups where I've tried to bring everybody up to this, this really high spiritual visual contact and people intuitively, instinctively move away from that experience because I think it's a level of intensity that most people don't want to go to, the average person. There's hardcore psychonauts that that's exactly what they want and they'll take as much of the drug that they need to to get there and they'll listen to the hardest core trance music or whatever they need to to get into that space. I would say that that is the exceptional person. The normal person who experiments with psychedelics wants to have a good time, wants to have fun, maybe wants to learn a little bit about themselves and bond with their friends, and that's it. They don't want the super hardcore visual spirit contact aliens jumping out of my chest experience. That is the, the very small percentage, the few of the hardcore. And uh, those are the people you should be studying, of course, because those are the people that uh, are, are most willing to go to that space and are most willing to uh, accept it and not be you know, blown away or immediately turn away from it once they get there. Because some people who go into that space and have that contact, their immediate reaction is, I want this to stop. I want this to stop right now, make it stop. And if you're doing research on people who have that mind,